Aye, so I've called a study of choice. Now, I want to say freedom of choice. Now, it may appear um, taken for the last couple of years, this is recorded in November 2021. Um, I've had COVID, I've had lockdown, it's ongoing. I feel it's if it'll be ongoing for a long time to come yet. Um, and many people think this is, we're going back to normal. There's no such thing as normal, but you have got freedom of choice. It may feel as if when we've been going through all of this, have been, you've had no choice of anything or how to be and how, how you are, but we always have a choice. And um, we always have a choice in how we move forward, how we present ourselves. And we have a choice, even when we think there's none. So you can have, you have a choice to choose to live in freedom to not be restricted by what other people tell you, to, 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 to lift the limitations of your mind, body and spirit, to move through this time and walk in a path of light, to walk to create a new earth, to create a new, a new beginning, a new future for ourselves and for the, for the younger generation and the, the people that are coming behind us, for the children of our future, um, to move forward in whatever way we see. We have a choice to how we participate or not participate, whether we join in, whether we make this decision or that decision, um, we can move through this as long as we work. Well, it doesn't mean to be as long as we do something. Working with your heart is a way forward um, and creating a better future and a, a, by making better choices for us all. At this moment in time, our planet is suffering um, the climate change, and I feel we could all make a choice and a decision every day and every week to do something better to improve the planet, to improve the way we live, to improve it for every other person. So all our needs are met, that not just all oh, because such and such has got so much money, that then they'll they'll be fine and they'll just leave the people that don't have anything that are struggling that needs to change. We need to bring in balance. So we've all got a choice to bring in better way of doing things, whether that's maybe if you're a baker, if you bake something and give it to your, your neighbor or your friends, or you take a meal to somebody and you make them soup, or whether it's just maybe you make a, a hat and a scarf or gloves for somebody who's got nothing to keep them warm. Um, looking how we can all change and make choices to make this planet the best planet here in this lifetime, because this is our future and for future generations to come. So making small choices and decisions just now in our daily lives has a bigger, wider effect on everybody we come in contact with. And each choice I see us all collectively um, connected. So each choice and decision you make affects the next person, affects the next person, affects the next person. So if we can all make a better choice in daily choices and weekly choices, and we have, maybe have to go back and readdress that um, constantly. Um, I'm not saying I do everything perfect. I don't make that. Sometimes I don't make the right just choices or the right decisions, even though my guides tell me, you know, um, this is blah, blah, blah. And I maybe just say, oh, I don't know why they're saying that to me. And I go and do something the complete opposite. And then I think, why didn't I listen to that? Why didn't I listen to what they were bringing forward? So we may have to go back and readdress the choices and decisions that we make. Uh, and that may be a constant reevaluation in choices and decisions and how we move forward. And then, anyway, let's all make better choices for not only for ourselves, but for every other person that we come in contact with that lives on this planet, that every living being, to be kind to animals, to be kind to every living person. And that even if you just start with that, then move on and develop that as you move forward in your life to make this world a better place to live and be. Thank you very much.